MAPS 3 is a, a one cent sales tax initiative, and this is actually the third version of that. It is going to raise $777 million for eight different projects, and we're currently raising about $8 million a month just on that one cent sales tax. Well, at the river, there's several phases that we've got going on right now, and we've completed um, part of phase one, which was the, the river lighting. So now we have a flat rowing facility that is the only permanently lit facility in the world. The third phase is the whitewater rafting facility that we're all really excited about. It's, it's actually pretty simple from an engineering standpoint. It's, it's a large volume of water that is pumped up to an upper reservoir and Mother Nature just does the work with the water running essentially downhill. The blocks that we use to, to, to make the whitewater are adjustable also so that let's say five years from now everybody's used to the way the whitewater facility is working. We can adjust those and make it a whole different experience. There's you know approximately 12,000 cubic yards of concrete going in on the job. Um, that's the course as well as the buildings. You're looking at major utilities going across the site and essentially you know it's, it's just a lot of concrete, a lot of dirt and a lot of utilities. It's about a nine month process to just get through all the, those uh, construction elements. The dirt that we're importing is essentially from another city site. We're, we're bringing in, the number is about 115,000 cubic yards. And that kind of equates to about 1,200 trucks. And then what you're gonna see on the building, we're basically getting to the point where we can put the slab in, and then steel will come in over the next couple months. So you're gonna start to see some verticality to the main building. You'll start to see the pump station getting a little taller too. It's the control system for all the pumps. It's the control system for the conveyor, for the, uh, hydraulic gates that we have for the channel. It's essentially the, the breathing heart, so to speak, to the course. Everything, all the intelligence is inside of that facility. So it does all the hard lifting, it does all the thinking. That's really the beauty of this facility is that it's for both. It's for Olympic training and the, the elite athletes, as you say, but it's also for us. And, and there's also different ways that we can be involved. We can be involved through kayaking individually, or you can be in a raft with eight or ten people so you don't have to be an accomplished paddler to enjoy the, the rafting. We certainly expect this to be open in spring of, of 2016 for everybody to enjoy.